Hello everyone, welcome again in Engman YouTube channel. So in this video, we will learn about the function name date value in Excel. All right, this code or this function is important. For example, like this case, I have a column here, effective date column, and I have the dates, but the dates are written in a text format, as you can see. They are written in text format. And for example, I don't like this format and I want to turn, I want to convert the format from a text to a date format in Excel. Okay, I can do that easily. First copy, paste, and then I will set up the table. Right click, all borders, okay. Let's do this. I can use maximize equal date value. Okay. This is used to convert a date in the form of text to a number that represents the date in Microsoft Excel date time code. Okay. To turn a date, this one, the source, a date written in form of text. Okay. As you can see, they are written in form of text to a number, okay? And from a number, we will turn the number into a date, okay, in Excel system, okay? How do we do that? Open parenthesis, and you can see the syntax, that value within the parenthesis, we have date in text, which is this one, okay? That value of C2 is this one. Okay, a number, a number which is actually can be turned into a date in Excel code. Okay, first we can double click. Okay, to obtain all the effective dates in number. And we can easily turn them into date again in Microsoft Excel code by right click, format cells category from general so they are still in general for example to date okay this is the date system and for the location i prefer using united states system so i click and maybe you like this one also i prefer this one okay so i have the date and then the month okay and then the year last two numbers for the year, and then the first three letters for the month. Click OK, that's it. So I turn this one, one April 2018 to this code or this format, which is better if you want to present this table into a report, into a paper or a book or presentation, right? This is better for a presentation or visualization. Okay, and that's all. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope the video is useful. Thank you so much for watching and see you again in the next Excel videos. Thank you.